Hi, 36 weeks and um, I'm feeling good, definitely more tired. Uh, we had a prenatal nurse come into the house this week and teach us everything that we need to know about labor and delivery and aftercare for the baby. So that was enlightening. <laughs> um, my husband and I also decided that we are going to keep and store the umbilical cord blood. And the reason being is I, I do have type 1 diabetes that run in my family. Uh, my dad has it and so does one of his brothers. Um, and it is genetic. So um, we actually heard a story recently of a boy who developed type 1 diabetes at age 8. And uh, he was able to get uh, umbilical cord infusion and it completely cured him. So that sold me. <laughs> I'm not taking any chances. So um, we arranged for that. It was about $1,300. And uh, we get a kit sent out to us. We've got to take it to the hospital. And then as soon as the baby's delivered, um, the company will come and pick up the blood and store it for us. I think it's about $125 to keep it in storage per year. Um, so I'm really happy we, we've done that, you know, it can be used for many, many other diseases as well. So other than that, we've been getting his room ready. We still are waiting for the crib and the dresser. So hopefully that comes this week, <laughs> fingers crossed, because I can really go at any time now. Getting excited. 